my presentation ready. All right. So I'm not sure you hear me. Oh, yes, sir. I have my presentation. Okay, right. But there's an Fine. issue with the font and I'm trying to fix it, so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anyhow, we will ask Siddharth to make the presentation first, and within that, I think you'll be fine, right? Yes, sir. Right. So you both are hearing yeah. the voice. Alvin, then you hear their voice? You hear their voice? I will, I will, I will. I will. Okay, let me officially start. All right, today is uh, March 26, 2022. And the attendees are Siddharth and Taneshwar from the US batch, Mitra and Yalvindan from the Indian batch. Dakshin Siddharth, Pranav will join tomorrow. CB is supposed to join, but I don't know if he hasn't turned up yet. Now, yeah, I would like to uh, explain this. And uh, Siddharth completes one year in MSCB sessions. Good job, Siddharth. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mitra. Right. Congratulations, Siddharth. Thank you, Tanesh, for... So Siddharth's dad called me yesterday to inform me that Siddharth will take a break for his examinations coming fast approaching. And uh, he has also told me that Siddharth will rejoin uh, during his summer, which is actually the final week of June. Now, even last year, uh, he joined the month of March and he has been spending some time for April and May and then he, uh, yeah, till the April he spent some time here in the MS evening sessions and he took a little break and then he rejoined the month of June, July. And uh, this time he's taking a complete break. So, am I right to that? Yes, sir. So, his dad is in India for personal reason and Siddharth is staying there. So technically speaking, today and tomorrow are going to be uh, this season's final session for Siddharth. Right. Tanishwar, you are continuing, right? Yes, sir. Okay, right. So having said that, without further ado, we will ask Siddharth Saunakumar to make his final presentation of this season. Sir, I have to, you have to enable screen sharing. Yes, sir, that's you. Okay, sir. Can everyone see my screen? Yep. Okay. Yes. Okay. Hello, everyone. Today, I will make a presentation on DNA. So I took information from a presentation me and Tanesh were made a long time ago, which was on macromolecules. That was also a good presentation. So what is DNA? DNA, or deoribonucleic acid, is a self-replicating material that is present in nearly all living organisms as the main con constituent of chromosomes. It is a carrier of genetic information. This is inside every single cell of our body, cells of our body. Cells are pretty much the building blocks of life. Building blocks of life. They look like little rectangles at a microscopic level, which means you can't see them with the naked eye. You need some kind of tool to look at them in genome. What is DNA made up of? Well, DNA is made up of nucleotides. Those are made up of three main components. A phosphate group, which is one phosphorus atom bonded to four oxygen atoms, a sugar molecule, and a nitrogen base. There are four different types of nitrogen bases. Guanine, which is usually represented with the C, and thymine with the capital T. These nucleotides are attached together to form two long strands that spiral out. This is called a double helix. You can imagine this as a twisting ladder. So. The history of DNA, the short history. Swiss chemist uh, Frederick Manshear first identified DNA in the 1860s, but it wasn't until the 1953 that James Watson, a Francis Crick, and Francis Crick, 
a biologist and a psych psychist respectively recognize that DNA exists as a three-dimensional double helix. After that, DNA accelerate. After the discovery of DNA, more and more researchers and scientists wanted to know more about this new thing that was inside of all of us, thus accelerating the rate at which new information was found about the DNA. And next, to have a small video. We can't hear it. Oh wait, can you hear the one? Yes, sir. Sir. So that what you'll have to do is, if the voice is not audible, you'll have to go out and again share with the share sound option. Uh, can you hear? I did that, sir. Can you hear it now? Yeah, we are hearing it now. Thank you, sir. Next, I have a small video to show about DNA. As some scientists worked to control life at the scale of global agriculture, others worked in a different direction. The mid-1900s was a period of re-examination of one of our big questions. What exactly is life? Let's talk about DNA and biotech. <laughs> Although the story is complex, it's often simplified to one big discovery of DNA made in 1953 by two dudes who won Nobels. Turns out there were also other people involved. By the 1940s, researchers knew that the cell nucleus contained thread-shaped structures called chromosomes that played a critical role in cell division. Chromosomes seemed to be made of a mixture of protein and other stuff. And this other key stuff was a molecule made out of carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, and phosphorus. This was deoxyribonucleic acid, or DNA. Isolated DNA looks kind of like a white powder, but no one knew DNA's structure. A molecule's structure, the way it fits together, tells us about how it works and maybe how to redesign it. In 1944, Austrian physicist Erwin Schrodinger, yeah, the cat, I published a short book called What is Life? reviewing this deceptively simple question. Scientists knew that there must be a unit of heredity, the gene that must be part of the chromosomes. Schrodinger examined the laws of physics, determining that the gene must be very small, only a few thousand atoms in size. It must vary, yet it must be orderly and not give rise to too many mutations. So Schrodinger threw down the challenge. How does this gene physically encode the information that defines life. He argued that this was among the most interesting questions facing science. And he suggested that one of the people best poised to answer it was biophysicist Max Delbruck. Delbruck ran a loosely organized network of researchers at Cold Spring Harbor Laboratory Caltech and elsewhere called the Phage Group. The group worked with viruses that parasite bacteria called bacteriophages. Viruses are just nucleic acids and little protein robot bodies. The Phage Group did important work on how life works at a small scale, using radioactive tracers inside viruses. But even they couldn't tell if it was the DNA part or the protein part of the virus that took over the bacterium. And no one could explain how either physically encoded information. So by 1950, the pressure to understand DNA was on, even though not everyone was convinced that DNA was the physical substrate of heredity at all. Despite this uncertainty, scientists set out to win this race. The most famous was American chemist Linus Pauling, who went on to join the short list of people with two Nobel Prizes. Pauling was an obvious choice because in 1951, he characterized the alpha helix structure of common proteins. He used an empirical approach, X-ray crystallography. X-rays, which have wavelengths much smaller than visible light, pierce molecules then scatter, making a diffraction pattern that reveals information about the molecule's shape. Crystallography is an incredibly finicky technique, but Pauling correctly showed how common proteins fold up into- And then he goes on to talk about things about extra crystallology, which isn't really, really related to the topic. But the video itself and all of his videos are pretty good 
a crash course 13.3 million subscribers hit all these videos are good they, they're very informational things like that and that is all for my presentation thank you for watching Good job, Siddharth. Thank you. Thank you, Mithra. Thank you. Siddharth, uh, post the the YouTube channel name in the chat. Crash, crash Course or Crash Course? There's a website. It's called thecrashcourse.com. Crashcourse.com. Okay. I'll, I'll put it in the chat. I think this is the link. Right. Oh. Dot com, not cp. Dot com. Okay. okay. Got both of your texts. Right. That was a beautiful video. So that's a fantastic choice. It was very well explained. Thank you. You got any questions? Anybody? Okay. So think over. I have a question to Siddharth Sanakmar. That was a very extensive, at the same time, very short form of explanation of, of, sorry, short form of explanation of DNA. And uh, in Sweden, there is an university that comes up with a research. Now they, they, they made a research in 1980 that the DNA is actually a form of um, some ancient borrowings of elements, atomic elements. That's what they find. Like it's the ancient atomic elements, sometimes visible, sometimes not visible. Some school of thought say that it is visible inside uh, the uh, atoms of the body. Every single atom of the body carries a segment of DNA. And another school of thought says DNA is invisible. It is a structural kind of an item. And it is present. Uh, it is completely opposite to the American Medical Association and the other the science gurus who have given research findings. Do you really think there are multiple schools of thoughts about the DNA as a concept? Or we will have to stick out to the real biological scientific information about DNA? Well, it's been proven many times over and over that DNA is an actual thing that can see it through microscopes. They've even taken uh, pictures and things like that. The only atomic, uh, atomic atoms or things like that, the only things we can't see are gases which are in the air and invisible, but we can see metals, alkaline metals, and everything else that is solid, even if it's dangerous, we can still see it. And then, well, there are some gases that are dangerous, but we can't see them, but that's only because they're gases. But if we brought their level, if, well, all most gases have a point where they turn into solids, that's by freezing them. I'm pretty sure by freezing them, you can bring them down to solid level and you can see them. But for DNA, it's already, it's already a solid it's just it's too small for us to see that's why scientists use microscopes that are that magnify things a lot so like things in front of you like a chair or a book those things you can't see the what's inside them you can see the big the big make, makeup of it but you can't see what it's made of like very no very small level but if you had a microscope you could see what they're made of things like that so microscope helps a lot looking at the dna Otherwise, you can't see it, and you might think it's invisible. Okay, that's a good answer. Before we go to Yalvin, let's answer. To cure someone with sickle cell disease, some doctors changed somebody's DNA and set it as a virus to cure the person, and it worked. All right, that's a very good input, Taneshwar. Yes, we have also read about it, and that's what is happening in COVID also. They put the exact virus into the body and make the body in the, in the, in the name of vaccine. Yeah, okay. Shed very good light, both of you. Now, Yal Vedan has a question. Mitra has a question. Yal Vedan. You can ask. The full form of DNA is deoribonucleic acid. It was very much available on the first slide that he displayed. This is 
you can't read because you are a okay yeah mitra siddha it was a very good presentation siddha my question is during the invention or during the discovery of dna or uh, in in the end or near 1980s if you were one of the scientists and if you wanted to alter or add some new feature to the dna uh, like uh, for example feature mean a context of feature dna is a double helix structure then it has as it can four nitrogen as base so adenine uh, cytosine guanine and thy uh, thymine so if you were belonging to that age and if you are also scientist which feature would you add or alter in the dna structure or dna composition Well, in the DNA composition, I myself can't add anything because that's how it is. If I wanted to add anything, I would have to use biotech to change the makeup of DNA and then make it look different or have different, uh, like it can change how the DNA works. Kind of like they work by the pairs of the four I said before, the four nitrogen bases. I can change those at maximum. I can't change how they look. I could, but then then it won't be a proper working dna that will work if i put it back in a human body so if i was to do that then the only thing i would change was the makeup of it to do the different job so if it said like this person has tall if this person is tall i could probably change it to say this person is short or this person is average height right that's a good answer any other questions okay right Good job, sir. Your presentation was really good and very informative. Appreciate that. Well done. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mitra. Now we have two more presentations today. One is from Thaneshwar. You have the presentation, and one is from Sibiyadi. So, Thaneshwar, you're up. Okay, sir. Can you see my screen? Uh, dark, completely dark. It's still dark. Is it working now? Yes. Okay. Yeah, now it's working. Okay. Uh, okay. So I made my presentation on environmental problems this week. So the introduction is. There are many problems around the world, and they all happen in different countries due to their location, and they can be from any type of variety of problems. But like, there's one problem that every place has in common, and that problem is not keeping the environment safe, such as pollution and other factors. So the first thing I'm going to be talking about is air pollution and the causes of air pollution. So air pollution is a mix of particles, and the substances in the air can pollute the air we breathe. In the United States, one measure of one measure of outside outdoor air pollution is the air quality index, or it's called the AQI, which is just the abbreviation, and it rates the conditions um, of the air quality around the country and. It has the concentration of five different pollutants, and concentration just means like how much of the pollutant is in there, and the and the pollutants are ground level ozone, particles pollution, or it's called particulate mat matter, carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, and nitrogen dioxide, and another one is carbon dioxide, but we see carbon dioxide every day, and then. Air pollution is also caused by a mix of particles because of these, so it's very tough to remove it, even if we're gonna try and fix it. Okay. So wait. No. So now I'm gonna be talking about the effects of air pollution, and air pollution can affect people's health as well as like. As well as uh, animals and other organisms that live. Let's 
Sure, can you hear him? I think Tanishwar, we are not hearing you if you're talking. Now, you have seen the air pollution slide stuck, and uh, you're not hearing punishment, right? He left the meeting, sir. Okay. Okay. So... Yeah, I w I'm going to be talking about the effects of air pollution. So the thing, uh, so air pollution can affect people's health and like animals and other organisms. And nearly one, like, and it can also give you like diseases and cancer, like heart disease and lung diseases and respiratory d diseases like asthma. And in the US, nearly 134 million people which is over 40% of the population, they're at risk of premature death because of air pollution and of all the different pollutants that are in it. And according to the American Lung Association, this shows how unhealthy the air can, the unhealthy hair can be dangerous to the body. And plus there's, uh, there are many people that are like just sensitive to air. So the symptoms will like affect them even more. And it can cause short-term problems like coughing, headaches, diz dizziness and stuff. And if we breathe in like the particulate matter and there's a possibility it comes into your bloodstream and it can go all around your body and it's going to affect and it's very dangerous to sensitive people or groups. Uh, next thing, okay, I'm going to be talking about the causes of air pollution, I mean, no, water water pollution. And water pollution is a large issue around the world. And since, you know, the most of the world is made up of water. So if you pollute the like all the water, that's like 70% of where we live. And the most common cause of water pollution is the mix of chemicals and acid spreading into the water. Plus there's also people that litter like this beach over here, the litter and the trash could also end up in the sea. And it could be from floating like plastic bags to chemical waste or like other bodies turned into like poison. And the contamination of water bodies means water pollution. And yeah, uh, all of these could like, like this could be like in any body of water. It could be lakes, ponds, oceans. Reser rivers, reservoirs, and etc. And this shows that water, that water around the world is getting contaminated so much and fast. And if it continues at this rate, there would be no clean water in the world. And here are some effects of water pollution. If polluted water affects us a lot, under hotter animals are you know threatened, and they're even more affected. And they eat the like you know they eat the trash that could be in the water and they mistake it for food, and many like sea turtles and whales and other marine animals, and one million seabirds die each year from air pollution, and digest in ingestion or entanglement in marine debris, which is basically just uh you know, debris is just trash that's in the ocean, and this can also show that careless people can just litter in bodies of water and they can cause all this debris to form and they don't think of how much it harms the water and they don't think how it can harm humans too and if you know some people eat fish and if the fish eats the plastic and then if we eat that that that's also harming us and the next thing i'm going to talk about is electronic pollution and this is on the more unhealthier side, because this all this falls into the category of air air pollution, but it it's not like the contaminants or pollutants that go into the air before. And this one this happens when like electronics get burned, and the metal that burns releases toxins into the air. So for example, people throw away like batteries, and 
they don't like recycle them properly so they just end up on landfills and on landfills they burn them and that's how this pollution can happen and computers and like most electronic devices they contain things like lead zinc nickel flame retardants barium and chromium so which it's it's all metals and it it's just more pollutants being in going into the air and this means that they shouldn't burn electronic pollution and there should be like a proper way of recycling these and this can also cause respiratory diseases and here are some effects and you know it most of these problems are respiratory diseases plus this could also happen with animals uh animals have you know have a worse immune system than humans so the symptoms that we have it's probably even more drastic for animals and it's dead it's deadly because it's a lot of it's more than like more like metal and pollutants than like the body can handle and when electronic waste is thrown away in landfills, the toxic materials also seep into groundwater. So this also kind of connects to water pollution and they affect both land and sea animals. And this can also affect the health of the people in developing countries where the electronic waste is dumped. And in developing countries, the government doesn't really notice problems. They're just trying to grow their country. Uh, the next one's thermal pollution, and the causes of this are, it's a type of pollution that is not much noticed, and it gets caused by factory emissions, and factories, what they do is they use water to cool down their machines, because it's easy, it's very easy to get water, and, you know, it's, it's free as well, they could just get it from anywhere they want, and the water cools the machines, like after they after it after they cool the machines they dump out the water they just dump it out they don't care about like properly like doing anywhere they dump it out like in these pipes and some bodies of water and the water contains like all the chemicals from the materials and from the machines so this could connect to electronic pollution and water pollution they get all the chromium zinc and all the metals and including the temperature because the, the machines are you know get really hot when they're running so all of that's going into the water and in the factory emits the water to other bodies of water and it can spread the chemicals and temperature from the machines to the body of water so this is main thermal pollution it's like temperature pollution where it does have pollution but it also heats up the water and it lowers the the life expense expectancy of animals and the sp the single biggest cause of thermal pollution is is industrial machinery and power plants and water is an excellent and free cooling agent and many i mean most factories use this and it's it's easy to cool it down with the machinery and they they don't know how to like properly get rid of it because their job is just to get it cooled or bad things could happen in the factory and cause even worse uh, things to happen and then so these are some effects and thermal pollution has a lot of effects and it's for it's mostly creatures underwater uh organism that they can't adapt really quickly it there's a process called natural selection where people where the org the organism that can survive will survive on to the next generation and they'll give the genes to the next one. So the ones that can't adapt quickly, they'll just die and they will tip over the skills and homeostasis and all that stuff. And there can also have there can also be reproductive problems and it can reduce the diversity of life in the polluted area. And then this shows that thermal pollution can have a big effect on organisms underwater. And the last type of pollution I'm going to be talking about is radioactive pollution. And this falls under the category of air pollution. So it's one of the most dangerous types of pollution. And it occurs when radioactive materials get released in the air. Um, you may have heard about Chernobyl when the power plant it exploded and a lot of radiation went on and people still have diseases diseases and health issues from that day to today and that was a long time ago so it's very dangerous if you know something like that happens and 
They get released into the air by nuclear reactors, and the destruction it could be caused is very hazardous, and it it's a lot of radiations, and factory emissions like over this 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 is a power nuclear power plant, and it can cause radio particles to spread in the air, and they release like deadly toxins that can kill kill people and organisms, and some effects are radioactive pollution can have a number of problems to the human body and radioactive particles can have a big effect on organisms and change their way of life and cancer is the most dominant radiant related disease it was developed over the years and poses great risk in global health and this shows that if you inhale radioactive particles it's the least harmful is cancer this shows that radioactive pollution is very dangerous so the least so people that we're lucky enough to live from Chernobyl and other accidents that may have happened. Uh, they probably have cancer and they're, you know, getting treatment and medication. And that's my presentation. Great job, Tineshwar. That's a great presentation. Thank you, Siddharth. Thank you, Mitra. Thank you, Yalvin and NCB. The uh, presentation format and the kind of the slides design and uh, the facts collection, the data analysis, and more importantly, you did not read the slides. You had been explaining. Did you notice that? He has been explaining every slide. He has not been reading it. So he showed the slide and he spoke. Showing the slide and speaking. That's what he did. So on that note, Tanisha, this is one of your best presentations. Very well done. Very well done. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, everyone. Questions? Anybody? Sibi Aditan. What is it? He is asking a question pertinent, pertinent to thermal pollution that you presented. Uh, if at all, the thermal pollution happens, and if a fisherman uh, captures a fish, and if Sibi Aditan manages to eat, eat that fish, what will happen to his body? Right? That's what he's asking. Yeah, so uh, the, the fish don't die because they eat the water. It's because it's not good for them, but... You know, fish do like swallow some water, and and the thing, and like all the there's a there's a bunch of chemicals when they release the water in there, and uh, you'll you know you'll you'll get some bad health effects, or you might need to go to the doctor or, or something like that. So like it's it's bad. The that yeah, it's bad, and it's also affected by temperature. So. Uh, the fish's insides may not be good either, and it, like it, it won't be good. Like in the picture I showed, uh, it was it had it had a lot of dust on it, and and it's already dead. So people aren't gonna like catch fish that's already dead and eat them because it's not fresh. So yeah. Okay, so that's Sibi's question. Anybody else? Any other questions? Okay. okay, so girls, the Taneshwaran is making his presentation. Video off when you just listen to it. I'll come back to you. So Taneshwaran, my question to you is, you had been asking, you had been asking, uh, I mean, you had been presenting about the various pollutions. Exclusively, you spoke about electronic pollution, which is the most dangerous Componential attack that could pose, and uh, these days, you know, apart from all the other uh, kinds of uh, pollutions, we ourselves. Again. Apart from 
getting exposed to the other forms of pollution we ourselves have we ourselves have started creating uh, electronic pollution by throwing off batteries throwing off some uh, non dysfunctional cell phones and all that so as the modern youngster what do you think is the solution for that because your presentation mainly focused on the <laughs> Yeah. yeah. What is the solution format for that? So, for batteries, I think like battery creators or the people that create batteries, like battery companies, like the one the the companies that create batteries and make profit off of them, they should be doing making like rechargeable batteries because. I have rechargeable batteries and uh the reason they still use normal batteries because they make money if you use normal batteries because uh when you use normal batteries it's going to run out and then you're eventually going to throw them out and then you're going to buy new new stuff but if you buy rechargeable batteries you can keep charging it and you can keep using it and you you won't need to throw that out so if you don't need to throw it out you uh it's going to like reduce the amount of pollution that's out there and uh for other like electronic stuff i feel like that's just on the government and what they do cuz if the government like you know makes some sort of you know some sort of solution in the un or something like that they could probably they could probably find a way to recycle or properly dispose them right well, that's a very nice answer Anybody else has got any other questions? Siddharth, do you have any questions to Dhaneshwar? No, sir. Okay. Well done, Dhaneshwar. It was a fantastic presentation. And this will be added Great up. Job. Yes. Thank you. Great job, Dhaneshwar. Thank you, sir. Thank you, everyone. Now, the third and final presentation of the day is Sibi Aditan's presentation. So girls, uh, Siddharth made a presentation on DNA. DNA being a concept, but he made a presentation. And Taneshwar made a presentation about the various forms of pollutions. So random science related topic. video And the video, he has watched half part of the video. Other he is going to present. So the girls at Bharat Zia, Siddharth and Taneshwar of the US batch, Mitra and Yalvindan of Indian batch. Just observe what Sibi Aditan is speaking and you can ask the questions if you want. Okay, sir. No, not now. Not now. Come. Come and stand here. Camera parra. Mingi engra parra. Hey, pin pinna di parra. Okay. Ready? Okay. Okay. Three, two, one. Okay, whatever you have to pack. Not about you alone. Good evening to one and a half My name is Didi Adikan. I'm going to present my presentation called uh, How to Start the Day. Uh, we, we don't know if we are don't know if we can up can the We don't know how to start. Then we learn this one and how we will we achieve. Uh, so my second question is going to start. Yes, and, yes. Uh, so you you are saying that you are uh, the what is this planted system? What is it? This planted system. <laughs> Super. Wow, right. You are asking me the question. Yes, sir. What is it called? 
daily lunch system. It's called daily lunch system, not plain disc lunch system. You prepare when you get all the daily lunch system. So you take some time and prepare properly. Yeah. Up there, no disc lunch system. That that was confusing. Tell me. Oh, that's the question. Tell me what's the question? What is a daily lunch system? The presentation. That meaning I understand. Daily launcher system was the title of the presentation that was given to Sibi. How to start a day? Abdiing kar do reya. Yet to step. So the entire video is for one hour. For the college lana workshop la, aungle kena training le purda pade thele. It contains eight steps, and the eight steps or video of purda thele. Sibi adi tan vande the paay na paay. The daily launcher system or a meaning it teriya me penge te get thele. So in the presentation, इधर के मारा continue पन्ना ना, नम्बर पाई थी मायरों। अन्य लोग full ला presentation ने prepare पनी था बस, इल्ल ready आ रखे हैं। अब बोल ले, इल्ल नी main है main लिए उनके doubt रखने बहुत मात्रा नहीं है। Second half सेमेस्टर नहीं है। Let's see, sorry, नी इन्ना तो prepare नहीं करना पाक। Sorry, prepare some points। Whatever you have prepared, बस। We should learn good things on the others, not bad things. ओके ही डिड नॉट प्रिपेर प्रिपेर पड़ा था But I'm uh, I'm really sorry about it. It was an embarrassment. Fine. Okay. So now, girls, uh, put on your video, please. Sir. Video put on, Kanna. The video, you guys are sir, on for no. Okay. Right. So, this is for the information of Siddhar Taneshwar Mitra Yalvendra and Sibya. So, the uh, the girls of Barzian Foundation are undergoing an activity called as the Rebellious People. And the Rebellious People, the bringer activity, le they have finished two rounds, and they have got the CRS marks for that too. If a third round, I will get admitted to Panama, and uh, the Indian batch, these three and the US batch, still have got almost about forty forty five minutes in their session. So I thought you can participate in the uh, activity as well. The third round, you will participate. Is that clear, sir? Okay. Yes, sir. All right. Yes, sir. No. Leave it. Leave it. You are not preparing now. Focus on the activity now. So they have got some teams. Or five teams are there, and the five teams la we are going to make it as seven teams for today alone. Ah, one third round matter quicker. I will finish. The seven teams. Sixth team is Siddharth and Taneshwar, and seventh team is Mitra, Sibhi, Aitin, and Yal. Okay, right. Now, listen to me very carefully. I was about to start. Properties use money. This will check your memory, and this will also check how far concentrating you are. Bharat Zian girls, if you have any note, put it. It's a memory task. You are going to memorize things. Illa, English, you know, our only thing that we have to do is to note. Put it. Okay, fine. You can note. Put it. No problem. I know the first time, but even in the my activities, many are under control. That's why even they are not doing it. Siddharth and Taneshwar will not know. Sibi, Alvendra, and Mitra will not know either. So, you guys want to note? Put it. 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 Put it.
using this 10 cups engitte ipa 10 cups irukku over cup e pathiyum edha onnu solli i will explain a story and the story ninga mudikanum mudikiradhu eppadi creative ah ninga mudikringa indradhu ungalude choice okay right right if you have a question na solradhu edha puriyala na because the weather is very very bad here there is a huge amount of uh, wind outside and uh, it is going to rain anala internet cut agirudhu power off agirudhu and something much happen so because of that if you are not hearing me properly just put your hand up i will understand yeah no no they will have to switch on the light anala light la panna venda summa avanga raise hand and kudutha pol right let's start the story 3 to 1 go this is a purple color cup and this guy's name is martin m a r t i n martin martin purple color cup this guy's name is martin martin is reading newspaper and in the newspaper he was reading about some science concepts martin newspaper padichittirukka appadi adhula avan read panniterundathu enna substance nu kettinga na science sambandhapatta vishayam and what origin of science he is reading something about botany chedigala patti padichittirukka okay i am done with this martin newspaper la padikumbodhu when he is reading about the botanical objects and the newspaper column la pakkathiley innoru per eludhi irukku this is a white cup white color cup and the newspaper la pakkathla eludhi irukra innoru per enna nu solli kettingala the name is rubina r u b i n a rubina so rubina abdingra oru ponna patti eludhi and the ponna and the ponna patti enna news nu kettinga na she is a cycle competition champion cycling la vandittu periya level achieve pannirukanga nu and the ponna patti she is reading now let's enter into rubina's house rubina ode veetla i'm showing this green color cup rubina ode veetla there are five individuals rubina her father her mother her grandfather and rubina's younger sister okay so and the rubina ode younger sister mobile phone la oru game velayandirukka small little kid is playing a game and that game's name is oxford o x f o r d oxford oxford over kapukku oru perum oru incident oru i'm done with this so far clear oxford 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 game la and the oxford game a thayaricha and the person oda per rubina oda thangachi kaiyile and the phone le robinson r o b i n s o n robinson now this blue color cup i have come to blue color cup ipo nama robinson oda office ku la po okay robinson is working on a new game app or pudhu game app la vela senjittu and robinson and the pudhu game app ku ipo dhaan per vechirukku and the per enna appdi solli kettinga na the successful plans c l a n s clan clashing clans ala irukliya indha mari the successful clans 
அந்த புது கேம் ராபின்சன் கிரியேட் பண்ணிட்டு இருக்க அப்படி அந்த கேமுடைய நேம் சக்சஸ்ஃபுல் கிளான்ஸ் ஸோ ராபின்சன் வந்து அந்த சக்சஸ்ஃபுல் கிளான்ஸ் அப்படிங்கிற அந்த ஆப்ப நைன்டீன் ஃபார்ட்டிஸ்ல தன்னுடைய கிராண்ட் ஃபாதர் ஒரு ஃப்ரீடம் ஃபைட்டரா இருந்தார் இஸ் கிராண்ட் ஃபாதர் வாஸ் அ ஃப்ரீடம் ஃபைட்டர் அண்ட் அவருடைய ஞாபகார்த்தமாக தான் இந்த கேமே அவர் ரெடி பண்ணார் ராபின்சன்ஸ் கிராண்ட் ஃபாதர் வாஸ் அ ஃப்ரீடம் ஃபைட்டர் பேக் இன் தைன்டீன் ஃபார்ட்டிஸ் அண்ட் இஸ் ப்ரிப்பேரிங் an app called as successful clans in memory of him and the grandfather's name is benjamin grandfather's name is benjamin now i got a sky blue cup benjamin oda a flashback ku po 1942 la benjamin was reading a book oru naal appo robinson chinna avara benjamin ku oru paiya irundaru anda paiya anda 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 paiya vandu chinna kolandha 1942 so benjamin vandu oru project la work pandrar enna na he is preparing a benjamin robinson appdi irundadnala avanga ella christians ana indians yaa vechukonga indian army la irukra oru person benjamin and he was a freedom fighter and benjamin designs a rifle to keep the indians stable in the british india british india la indians are stable ah vekkiradhukku he wants to fight against the british people and he prepares a weapon and he is designing that rifle the rifle avaru dhaan design pandrar so benjamin design pandra and the rifle ku peru benjamin just try just try ungala evlo உன்னால முடியும் உன்னால முடியும் சோ பெஞ்சமின் அந்த ரைஃபிள் வச்சுக்கிட்டு அவரு ரெடி பண்ணிட்டு இருக்காரு ஓகே அந்த ரைஃபிளுக்கு நேம் வேண்டாம் ஹீஸ் ப்ரிப்பேரிங் அ ரைஃபிள் அந்த ரைஃபிள ரெடி பண்றதுக்கு பெஞ்சமினுக்கு ஒரு பர்சனுடைய ஹெல்ப் தேவைப்பட்டுச்சு பட் அந்த பர்சன் ஹெல்ப் பண்ணல ஓகே ஹெல்ப் பண்ணல என்னன்னு பெஞ்சமின் என்ன பண்ணிட்டாரு அந்த பர்சனை கொண்டுட்டாரு using that right this is better right? hmm? yes, sir. that's it doubt sir yeah. you just tried to come you told sir it was starting it was taking the book in 1940 he was reading a book how to prepare a rifle abbing a book sir in the anji cup avanga team mate kitta mitra solraangala ma maybe that's an advantage for you to recall one more time so idu mitra is not only helping yalvendra and sivi she is also helping everybody okay pannunga you can sit because you are not getting covered in the camera so this purple color munadi va this purple color cup it states that not is reading a newspaper in that newspaper he is reading about what or something okay just two or three this lines this picture is enough for one cup he did not remember so much but try to relate it related to the color of the cup next white color means newspaper okay remember the newspaper color the newspaper would be white color no So uh, near to that body section, we have one column called as uh, column where that a new state about Rubina. Okay, Rubina. So this Rubina. is. Ah, uh, Rubina. Okay, that's a confused uh, event. Next, getting on to uh, Rubina's house. Uh, getting on to Rubina's house, we have five family members: Rubina, her father, her mother, her grandfather, and her younger sister. So green color means remember that it is Oxford. Over to over name, okay? For this Martin, for this Rubina, for this Oxford, okay? Ah, ah, okay. So Oxford is the uh, name of the university. Right? So keep that name. So it is the uh, Oxford is an app, a gaming app that is for younger students use. Next, this uh, uh, blue cup. It states the person that is Robinson who has prepared that Oxford game. So Royal Blue, sir Robinson. Okay. So Robinson, Royal Blue, the color color. Royal Blue. Ah. So Royal Blue, sir Robinson. Okay. No, remember like Peter Robinson. So what Robinson is doing is he prepared the, the game in account of his grandfather who was the leader of the country in 1940. Okay. Ah. 
Dates is plan. Uh, no, that is that's the last one. No, that is success. Success plan. Next, the last cup, the fifth cup. So far, five cups. The fifth cup uh, is uh, when Robinson's grandfather was reading a book in 1942. Okay. Uh, when Robinson's son, that is Robinson, Robinson's grandfather's son was a small child. Uh, at the time, he was reading a book that taught him and that demonstrated how to prepare a rice. So once he prepared the rice, he actually, uh, before preparing the rice, he asked for help from a person, an old person. But as he did not help, uh, Robinson, uh, Robinson's grandfather shot him. So this, uh, enough. 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 Uh, enough. 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 No more questions. No more questions. I'm a Martin Motor Mari Pora. Now, you know, Anji Kap Sirke. Now, I'm going to give six and seven. Eight, nine, ten, and Igada Mudikano. The team has to creatively finish. And I will ask questions for each team. That's your task. Team talk will be given. Even a Manga Mudichon. Where did we stop? Okay. So, Benjamin shot that person who failed to cooperate. And the Kila Vulundi Yarandu Pona and the person who appeared. Surendar. Surendran. S U R E N D A R. Surendar. Surendar or a family club. When Surendar was shot by Benjamin, Surendar's daughter was so upset. And in 1942, she started an orphan home in the name of her dad, Surendran Memorial. orphan Aramcha. Daughter and the Pondu Pere Divya. The name of the girl is Divya. So Divya starts up an orphan home, and that orphan home is. Uh, named as Surendran Memorial. Surendran Memorial is a giant one. Now, Kita Tete Ambatanjipair. Fifty five beneficiaries joined Surendran Memorial. The sponsors or as members? As members. As members. Sponsoring Elame Divya Namata. As members. Adila. 1943 joined one person or a family or china family and the memory in the joint orphan family you know the husband was an orphan he had his wife and he they had their daughter is it 1943 long joined memorial 2022 and the time so let's go into surendran memorial Surendran Memorial Klopola. Okay? And the memorial is uh, modernized. Coimbatore district, Tamil Nadu, India, and popularity of the popularity of the memorial. Now, the Surendran Memorial is uh, chief. Okay? The chief of Surendran Memorial. This is Divya. Divya passed away because Divya was 1942, 27 years of age. So she passed away. If a Divya would you know, successors, edit the Narathi Trikan. Okay? Ipo. There are three more links. That is three more cups. Idem are a chain of creativity. Cut a seal at climax, Yenka on the Modino. One person sitting and reading the newspaper, and he was reading about a botany news. Abdin Pathete, I think a pocket letter over a news Abdin Soli or a girl or a name sonna. Don't say the name now. Anga on the Mudino. At the end, Surendar Memorial Lerende, Anga on the Mudino. Mood a cup of the Patal Anji cup. I wish twelve cups, other than another good number per all. One, two, three, and twelve. So now in a seven instances Mudista. Cup number one, purple cup. You know it is white cup. You know what it is associated. Green cup. You know what it is associated. Blue cup. You know what it is associated. Sky blue cup. You know what it is associated.
Again, apple green cup, you know what it is associated. And finally, red cup, you know what it is associated. This is the Mitra a quick recap. Now we have got a, a beach cup, a pink cup, and an yellow cup. I need five instances. Seven by me, and you need to think of five. And it has to come and stand, and it has to come to the ending point of the man who was sitting and reading the newspaper with the botany news on the paper. So think. Creative or Yosin. Sorry? Can we note down the five? Ah, you can note down the five instances. Now, I have to recall the question questions so over the team. Okay? Okay? Pakla. You don't have memory, logical reasoning. I bring it along. You have a team? Yes. With regard to this seven cups. Correct. 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 So, team talk, every year, good now. Mitra, Yalvin, and Sibi, they will be out. Barzi uh, and girls, they will have their physical team talk. Siddharth and Taneshwar, in the window, they have team talk. So, let us not over here, let us not over here, Siddharth and the Taneshwar's team talk. They have private team talk. So, how much time do you want? First, we will ask Bharatji and girls. You have a time when you team talk again. Girls. Sir, 10 to 15, sir. Yeah. Okay. 10 to 15, sir. 15 minutes. Siddharth, Tanishwar. 15 minutes should be good, sir. Okay. Yeah. All right. 20 minutes. Siddharth and Taneshwar will start the presentation. Pagla, you are first ready. Bye. Bye. See you. Okay, all the best and enjoy your team talk, boys and girls. Sir, today Priya and Kamal are absent, sir. Where are you? Sir, Priya is going to the project in Soli College. You are going to the college, sir. Okay. Kamala Kaku, what am I saying, sir? Sir, you're going to prepare. Okay, sir. Right, okay. 20 minutes. All right, so. Now, we are going to have the presentation. First team is this team. Mitra, Yalvendra, and Sibiyatan, because anytime in another 30, 35 minutes, Mala Penjit Pukit. So Sibiyatan and Yalvendra's parents might come a little early today. So, Yonga uh, Murishatu, right? And then Siddharth Taneshwar, let them also finish. And then we will relieve all of them. Apro, I will spend time with Bharatji and girls. Mitra, are you ready? Yes, sir. Hey, Mukar. So you can take this. Keep your phone on, on the table. Akas, Aprino Rwat English. Okay, so first presentation is going to be from Mitra, Yarvin, and Sibya. So you have the mic. Yes, sir. You can hold it. That should be in the right. That should be in the right. Mine should be in the right. Yes, sir. Right, come on. So, three, two, one, go. Okay. Can you go, Pesu? Siddha Yellow Pass of Point, or of the Girls, go there, I'm a speaker, right? Guru Mokal, you go to some text, and you are a Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. A warm greetings, one and all present here. So now I would like to start with the eight sequence. Totally there are 12 sequences. Sir has completed seven sequences and I'm going on with the eight sequence. Nine sequence will be uh, explained by Yal Vendan. Ten sequence will be explained by C.B. Aditan. And the remaining conclusion, I will be giving it. So first sequence. So we ended uh, the seventh sequence by saying that there was a person that is 
the daughter of the person who got killed by benjamin that daughter actually opened a memorial memorial that is orphan home in name of his her father that is surendra surendran memorial so from this on i would like to continue that is there is a family who has joined in that uh, uh, home and in 19 section by section vitla mudichona na edukku or safety ku ungalku tamil la explain okay okay sir in 2003 that is actually divya surendran built the home in 1943 in 2003 that is 60 years since they have built the home uh, unfortunately divya surendran passed away and divya surendran's daughter own do- daughter named diya was the one who took hold who got the power of the home that is orphan home and she started administering things like let's imagine she was around 40 or 50 years of age in 2003 so once after few years like near 2015 dia's friend she has a friend named kritika so kritika's family that is kritika's family consists of kritika her husband and her daughter ritanya but unfortunately due to an accident both kritika's kritika and her husband passes away so ritanya is an orphan now so what ritanya does is she goes and admits herself in the orphan home so this is the first sequence the first sequence is actually uh, divya's daughter dia takes hold of the uh, orphan home dia's friend's daughter that is ritanya has been admitted into the orf- orphan home and she is completing taking care of her education in the orphan home the second sequence will be explained by yal vendan and it is the next ஒரு <laughs> 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 and ritanya admitting in hospital uh, orphanage owner admit uh, ritanya in in the hospital the doctor name is uh, tilak and tilak is a duplicate and fraud uh, fraud doctor and uh, he don't know how to treat a patient and he is uh, try to try to kill uh, ritanya and ritanya know the new know about tilak and he and he uh, and he went to some people and he asked and he asked uh, can you please help me uh, 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 a doctor called tilak is trying to kill me like that ridanya is saying and they are not uh, uh, they are not uh, testing ridanya and then uh, and then ridanya uh, not testing and ridanya ரிதன்யாங்க and the uh, that is her friend are not in good terms uh, they were, they did not have a good relationship with each other and once kritika passes away ritanya does not know that they were not in good terms and she gradually she 
uh, we did not know anything about the uh, orphan home as that was the only orphan home that was famous in the whole country she joined that orphan home she did not know that she was the uh, she was the daughter of kritika who was the enemy of dia so now she is admitted in the orphan home and dia has a grudge towards ritanya so that's why uh, dia and tilak dia has grudge towards ritanya prince solra apdi grudge apdina oru vidamana edirpu oru vidamana kovam adha grudge apdinga yeah and uh, dia and tilak are the ones who have plotted the entire idea for murdering ritanya so two sequences over we shall get on to the 10th sequence Then sequence will be explained by Sri Aditya. Sir, the wire is going to cut. Okay, now. Okay. Chips. Huh? Now the chips is not going to cut. Okay. So the Tilaksa to your daughter trying to kill Rudhanya. So he felt something wrong and he got up and go. Uh, go and tell to his friend. His friend, yeah, uh, Anu, and Anu, Anu was, uh, Anu was coming saying, and uh, 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 he was saying in the, then he was saying in the hand movement, and okay, the Anu was understand that uh, he was a fraud doctor. That like understand and come and they see, see. See the, uh, see the, the fraud doctor, and he was uh, oh, the Anu was also see, and he was trying to oh Tilak also see, Tilak sees he was Jhani was sees, so and he come and uh, trying to kill uh, Anu also hey, then. Okay, so that Janeshwar and girls, the Yalvendan's uh, parent has come. That is Yalvendan's uh, uh, uncle has come, so he's supposed to leave. So take now, put still leave tomorrow. Okay, everybody, say bye to Yalvendan. Bye, 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 Yalvendan. Bye. 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 Bye, Alvinden. Okay. Bye, Alvinden. 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 Bye
who thinks well and who narrates story crime stories well so so near that story that is near the body we have a crime thriller story where the story starts with the name of rubina a hierarchical a hierarchical order continues till where the story ends with pradeep pradeep who's helping ritanya and ritanya is trying to uh, do uh, with the help of some operation ritanya is recovering gradually and pradeep was the one who saved all those so at the end of the story martin reads the biological section and uh, so corresponding to that we have a crime thriller section where the same day story is narrated nine sir oh sorry sir sorry sir oh thank you akash thank you thank you sir mitra Good job, Mitra. Siddharth and Tanisha, were you saying something? I was just saying you said good great job. job. Oh, thank you so much, Siddharth and Tanisha. Thank you, Akash. Right. <laughs> All right. So Mitra, Sibi, and Yal Vendan finished their task. Um, without taking time, uh, Siddharth and Tanishwar are going to take a presentation. After that, Mitra and Sibiyatan should leave because their parents, I mean, Sibiyatan's parents will also come. It's 7 o'clock already. So, girls, I will listen to you. Yes, sir. 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 So after the part where Divya made the orphanage, she finds out that two kids in her orphanage fight often, and they just fight all the time about things, about even the smallest things like where they're gonna sit, things like that, what food they're gonna eat, where they're gonna sit, how what games they play together or whatever. They have rivalry with with each other like that, but they're still friends as far as she's seen. Then she goes, she finds out that. Later, she thinks that something is wrong with this. Like, why are they like this? Why aren't they just normal friends or just hate each other normally? Why are they like? Why do they hate each other but they're still friends? So they looks. So she looks into the past, into the kids' past, and then she finds out that the families of these two kids they used to be very rich and famous, and they had like a good, a good friendly rivalry with each other as being good, great companies. So then she finds out that these. Families were in a horrible freak accident that got them both killed. But since these two kids were too young to understand, they uh, the families left the kids at home with someone to take care of them. But figuring out the they wouldn't come back, the families were put into an orphanage, home like this, and like they are in right now. So the first sequence for this would have been where uh, Divya searches around their past, searches around and looks into their past of the kids. To figure out what happened, and the sequence after that would be the care, would be, explain would be explaining of the two families' rivalry together, explaining the two rivals together, and then sequence after that is the uh, is the freak accident. So the two families, the, since of all the rivalries at one point, they wanted to come up with an agreement so that they can make them both rich and more even more famous. Because right now they're both stopping each other from doing that, coming one upping each other. It's like Apple, whatever Samsung, whatever. So if Apple creates a new model, Samsung create a new one like that. Keep keep getting new ones and new ones. So both of them aren't able to get their full fame. But if they work together to create one good model, both of them will get fame instantly. So when they when they went to one location to get and sign an agreement to do this. A freak accident takes place, killing both the families and everyone in the site, leaving the kids orphanage, and that is where I end the story. Thank you. Well done, so that's and the Danish work. Uh, yeah, I've been listening to the team talk. Both of you had been shaping up the story. And uh, Danish, would you like to add anything? Uh, yes, sir. Well, um, I the I would just like to add that like the main cause of this was just like the rivalry between the two parents, and uh, 
Yeah, and then me and Siddharth thought that thought those through together. So yeah. Yeah, I totally get it. I totally get it. So good job. Very nice creativity, and uh, you have just uh, help helped uh, you know in a way to come to the conclusion for the story. Now, very quickly before we leave and before I continue with the, our girls here, what's the learning from you for today? That I have written many books that like this order we will be having. So what we are supposed to do is we are supposed to come from the back here. Like for example, Martin, Brother Pradeep, Pradeep, Sir Anu, like this, we would, get, we would be getting the order, sir. So this helps in critical thinking, sir. Right. Because when we plan for the things, we uh, think very critically and also be able to have a cohesiveness oh, between yes, them, sir. And uh, it should be easy for us and at the same time understand. Sir. Understand. One more. One more. One more. Memory. Yes, sir. You see, you see. You, what did you learn today? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, today I have learned this. Uh, 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 how, how to write it? <laughs> logical reasoning and logical thinking and how to write a story. Siddharth Thaneshwar, quickly. I mean, uh, what's your inference from this? From the beginning, it would be memory and like remembering the association between the cup and the name and the events related to it. And after that, we come up with the story of our own, it's like critical thinking, I guess, related to the stories and remembering them and, and then looping it back to the beginning. Yeah. Okay, right. Anishwar, your thought? Uh, yeah, just like Siddharth said, it involved a lot of memory with like the character cups and all that. And then uh the other part of it i think it's creativity because uh you you can, there's like many ways to think of a solution so yeah right good job good job okay girls siddharth and girls siddharth last year march led join banare he is a ninth grade student kanisha priya mitra tanishwar siddharth so he's a ninth grade student. One year I did say. So from next week onwards, April 1st week, Siddharth is going on a break. Taneshwar attend, but Siddharth is going on a break. Exams He has got a lot of assignments, homework. So Siddharth Appa is a very good senior friend of mine. So our So he's going to go for a break up a summer vacation. America la summer vacation. Namalakala summer vacation, April, May. Summer vacation, if you say that, vacation. No. Right. Pagla. So, vacation, I will watch it. Summer for Indians, uh, you know, March, April, May. Adha. Americans, not for Americans. Siddhartha and Tanisha are Indians. Na. America la summer na July. June, end and July. So, Siddhartha will come back in July. So, Girls, would you like to wish all the best for Siddharth for his exam? He's going on a break. Come on. Yes, sir. Yes. All the best, Siddharth. Anna. Siddharth. All good luck, Siddharth. Thank, all you. The best, Siddharth. Okay. Thank you. All the best, Siddharth. You have been doing. <laughs> doing, doing. He's doing, been doing. Doing a great job in all the actions. Your presentation, the topic, the PPT, 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 the Hope is our life. Kanisha Priya would have said much. Hey, class, mudi lada, irung lada. Hey, expect get the news. Party will come over. Hope is our life. So, nigga, okay, expect get. Get the news for Peter. With that, um, I will talk to Saranan sir. You have won the CRS 2.0. Uh, both you and Tanishwar have won CRS 2.0. I will talk to him. Good job. So you are earning 1,200 rupees Indian net rate as your cash price. 
and I will send a e certificate for you and Taneshwar. Okay, so that and Taneshwar. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Thank, thank you, sir. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, Taneshwar, when uh, not for the month of March, but for the month of April, when Dad is paying the fees, ask him to direct thousand two hundred and ask him to give that money to you. And Siddharth, I will talk to Sanandan sir. He will give that money to you, and that's my gift and my cash price to you, both of you. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. All right, Siddharth Taneshwar. So, girls, we will continue. Now, Mitra, well done today. Very well done. Sibiyadhan, good job. So, Mitra, Sibiyadhan, Taneshwar, and uh, Siddharth, see you tomorrow. We are continuing tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow, sir. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, everyone. Bye, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, sir. Okay. Bye, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, sir. Okay, okay, yes. let's see you now. Bye. Bye. Follow another okay. All right, bye, bye. 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 Right. Hey, you are running by soon. Sir, coffee. Sir, comedy, comedy. Cherry, okay. Cherry, start one. If you want to give an explanation, you can give an explanation. Come on. Okay, sir. And the team first start one. Ajumal? Sir, yes, sir. I appreciate you for taking the step in speaking in English to wish Siddharth. Thank you, initiative. sir. Very good. Thank you, sir. Sir, can you team? Hi, sir. Okay. Good evening, sir. Hi, Ganesha. Good evening. Now I will start my presentation. Uh, sir will tell 10 sequence, 7 sequence, sir will complete, I will continue 8 sequence, 8, eight sequence, sequence. Uh, pink color, uh, Divya will continue that, Sundaresh, uh, Surendra Memorial Hostel, very well, Sundaresh, uh, black color cup, Sir, the hostel is Sundarayana Memorial, sir. Our pair is Sundarayana. I'm going to take a photo. That's my dad. Our pair is Sundarayana. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. I'm going to take a photo. I'm going to take a photo. Surrender Memorial Hostel Students 10th is 17. Sir, 
Rebecca ah. sister will continue that in sequence sir. Okay, Rebecca sister. Continue. Good evening, sir. Good evening, Kanimori. Orange color cup, 70 mm. students. Uh, Seven, finally, seventy students. All of all of you read the newspaper in botany section. Okay. That's, that's Fantastic. Also Very good. Very good. Well done. Well done. Well done. Okay. So Kanisha Priya and Kanimori Park Kama Pesir Kanga. That's very very important one issue. Right. So, they part of continue to continue. Now, which team is next? Good job, Kanisha. Good job, Kanimori. Well done. Alex Sophia, thank you, sir. Alex Sophia. Sir, good evening, sir. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, Alex. Tell me. Um, sir will explain. <laughs> Sir will explain. Ten, ten, seven, seven, seven cups. I start uh, three cups. <laughs> okay, sir. sir, pink cup is uh, Divya was developed in their hostel. Okay. Um, hostel works run goodly. Um, in in nineteen forty three, Divya. In Divya Hostel, and uh -huh. 53 children, 53 people uh, was there. Uh -huh. uh, in, uh, next 2022, um, 200 people was came in okay. the Sundaresh, this is Surendar Hostel. <laughs> okay. Uh, next, uh, Orange Cup. Okay. Um, um, the character was uh, uh, the character was see see this Divya hostel and uh, appreciate Divya hostel. Uh -huh. Then character was uh, uh, plan to give Divya hostel one Divya 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 two Divya two Divya two or Divya. Divya, she, the character was planned to give Divya uh, to give a award to Divya. Uh. Um, next, uh, Black Cup. Uh, then Divya uh, to, in 2022, August 15, Independence Day. Independence Day then Divya, uh, that one and um, that day meeting was go. go uh, Go, Divya. Okay. <laughs> right, was, right, right. Continue, continue. Huh? In stage, character was uh, uh, tell about Divya, Divya sauce, uh, Divya work. Hmm. Then character was give award to Divya. Hmm. Then news was uh, uh, spread TV, <laughs> TV newspapers. <laughs> And all, uh, and all medias. Hmm. Then asked Divya's daughter was see the news in newspaper and appreciate Div Divya. That's all there. Wow, fantastic. Fantastic. Good. Very well. This is your best presentation. In the presentation, Thank you, presentation. you spoke very long and you spoke really good. Tell them, tell them. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, you know the Mukti Mana Vish. Ah. Sundaresan, Sundaresan, every name le. Ida da Sundaresan, original Sundaresan. Right. Thank you. <laughs> So in the photo, the angle is a clearer version. Another one. Okay, fine. Okay. Padrigla, Madita. Alagar coming, sir. Thank you. There's a deal of a living there. 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 
எங்க அப்பா அப்ப இல்ல தெரியும்ல என்னங்க சார் அப்பா இல்ல டாட் இஸ் நோ மோர் அவர் இல்ல போ தட் ஐ நோ சார் பட் யுவர் ரோல் மாடல் இஸ் யுவர் फादर्स நோ சார் எஸ் கரெக்ட் யுவர் ரைட் மை ரோல் மாடல் இஸ் ஓன்லி மை டாடி எஸ் ஓகே ஓகே ரைட் கனிஷா கனிமொழி அண்ட் அலெக்ஸ் மை ரோல் ரோல் மாடல் யுவர் ரோல் மாடல் இஸ் ஆல்சோ யுவர் டாட் ஃபைன் குட் ஐ நோ தட் Kanisha sir Kanimori. your voice is breaking sir Is it okay now Sir Ipo okay varna Ah yes sir Okay so Kanisha Kanimori and Alice Sophia have done real good job Sari adutha yaar which team is giving the story narrations Ah, sir, uh, Ajma's team, sir. Yeah, yeah, please. Hello. Hello, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening, Ajma. Already... already you complete seven sequence we are going to the eighth sequence to complete 10 sequences okay the eighth sequence is till a fatima okay good evening sir good evening ma good evening we moving to the in charge of the jungle Surrender and Surrender Memorial. We need a sponsor for the memorial. So the sponsor helping the 53 students. The name was Prema Lata. Is a local. We going to the Prema Prema Lata's home. She is a very rich and also she is a scientist. Scientist. When a when a children. What is the name? Childhood. Childhood. She is a very poor family and a very suffer. Hey. Well, 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 nicely explained Angelica. Sandra. Good evening sir. Good evening sir. Good evening Sandra. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hey father. Yeah father. approach approach he him him the and she and she become the best woman the best scientist the father the father name is name is raghava that is the peach cup peach cup yes sir we are going Uh, we are going to the raghava's childhood past raghava is a very poor man a, fo- a family was very poor uh, she mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, raghava is a publisher uh, he she is a very, uh, he is a very honest honest man he is a honest man uh, madan is a assistant for assistant for the ragwa ragwa uh, one day ragwa said to madan her past story how she, how he come this position uh, madan uh, ragwa suddenly dead madan madan one day think to put this story in newspapers or television something 
so Madan was put this in newspaper um, that the, this is the black cup. So that way Madan's son is the my uh, Martin. So Martin was reading the newspaper. <laughs> It's a fantastic story. Very good. Ajimol, Angelica, and Sandra. Very well done. Nice story. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Right. So, uh, Alice Sophia did for her team. Kanisha and uh, Kanimori have done for their team because Kamala was absent. Ajimol, Sandra, and Angelica have finished. Now, two more teams left. That is uh, the team of uh, Kitiga and the team of Emma. So, Emma Janine, Ramya, Abhinandini. Wanga, come to the front. Uh, now, Emma or a team continue to Gunadi. Sureshan or a daughter or a birthday group to Karangla, Poringla. You are like the same, and the words it does. Now early, Yasuna. Then you are you Sir, you 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 Class and Buddhist seven thirty keep an acquaintance through Kalamari. Go away, night. Nana with Ron Kalamaro. Kalamite, Kalil and Guaramudi. Other than the end of plant in the Sina Sati and not a student, Triola Sapna, Sapna or a husband, Sakti, Sapna, Hindi teacher, the Kangla. Yes, sir. Avanga a husband, Sakti, or even then a student. So Ungla Hindi class, Angla Suresh and get another recommend by Solid. So now, when the car is coming, they will put it in the car. The plan is March 16th, and the But uh, unfortunately, I'll enjoy it. I'll take photos. Okay? Thank you, sir. Please, sir. Sir, I'll cancel Please, sir. Please, sir. Please, sir. Please, sir. Please, sir. Yamadar could have been done. I've been a solar sonna and a public war. Now, Varangar, now, you're getting one show, one show, one show. Now, Varangar, I'm looking for money from any Anakuntari, but not any. We should not get disappointed earlier. Now, Pagra, much even. Thank you, Pagra. Thank you, Pagra. Thank you, Pagra. Ning at the morning pouring, eh? Ten o'clock in the ten ten thirty in the camera. Right, right. Okay. Tell. As an Alexandri, Nali Pakla, Ipo, Munu Mukiman, a Perry Manshang of Kanga, Emma, Emma Abinandani, and Ramya. Sir. Yes, Yama. Sir, I went to. Adu Vande Na Enna Solo Varanda. Adu Adu Vande Na Enna Solo Varanda. Na Uvite Enna Solo Varanda. Naanga prepare panle. Adana. Sir, Adu Tamil la thari usaranko. Adu Tamil la solanga. Ah. Adventi, 
அதுக்கு ஒரு இது அதாவது அந்த அது இருந்ததுன்னா அந்த இது வந்து நான் என்ன சொல்ல வரேன் சரி ஓகே ரிலாக்ஸ் ரிலாக்ஸ் இமேஜின் ரிலாக்ஸ் ஒரு <laughs> Kamala is yeah, absent. Yeah, ah, yes, Abhinandini. When the hostel uh, developed by Divya. Divya Aspen <laughs> is named by Karan. He also helped in the surrender number here. Yeah. So that was the our incident. That day, I told you. That day, I told you. One day, I believe. Emma, Jane, Rami, Abhinandini, all of you are talking. Sir, I am 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 talking. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sir, that is the team. Last but by no means the least, Kirti Ghar's team. Kirti Ghar is sleeping, sir. Kirti Ghar is sleeping, huh? yeah, isn't it? Sir, she suffers she suffer from leg pain, sir. Leg pain, sir. Okay. So, cool, sir. Cool, sir. ஐயோ எப்படி விழுந்தாங்க நல்லா இருக்காங்க சரி ஓகே ரைட் கீர்த்திகா டீம்ல மத்த ரெண்டு பேர் இல்லையா கமலா இல்ல ஒரு ஜீவன் இருக்கு மேங்க சரி ஓகே பரவாயில்ல பரவாயில்ல நாளைக்கு சொல்லுங்க ஐ மீன் மண்டே பாத்துக்கலாம் ஐ மீன் டியூஸ்டே பாத்துக்கலாம் ஓகே ரைட் அப்ப இன்னைக்கு கமலா நம்பர் ஒன் தென் ரம்யா ஐ மீன் சாரி பிரியதர்ஷினி நம்பர் டூ அண்ட் கீர்த்திகா மூணு ஆப்சன்டே சார் எஸ் சார் சரி ஓகே சோ ரிபல்லியஸ் பீப்புள் அப்படிங்கிற இந்த ஆக்டிவிட்டியை இதோட முடிச்சுக்கலாம் அண்ட் டியூஸ்டே தட் இஸ் நெக்ஸ்ட் வீக் நம்மளுடைய அடுத்த வாரம் வி வில் ஹாவ் அ நியூ ஆக்டிவிட்டி and the activity la we will have a different kind of approach so tomorrow you are uh, you are off you are off it's a sunday nalaik enak class irukku evening ivangalukku class irukku siddharth staneshwar class irukku and monday um nane ungitta one kaamikkanu nenacha i mean inge or college irukku and the college la value added skills abdinu one irukku and the value added skills abdingara and the topic la BCA students, அவங்களுக்கு நான் கிளாஸ் எடுக்கிறேன் கம்ப்யூட்டர் அப்ளிகேஷன் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ்க்கு அறுபத்தெட்டு பேர் இன்ட்ரெஸ்டட் சொல்லி நேம் கொடுத்துருக்காங்க அந்த அறுபத்தெட்டு பேருக்கு முப்பது மணி நேரம் நான் ட்ரைனிங் கொடுத்தேன் எவ்ரி டே ஒன் ஹவர் ஒவ்வொரு நாளும் காலேஜ் ஹவர்ஸ்ல ஒரு மணி நேரம் இன்னைக்கு காலையில மூணு மணி நேரம் எடுத்தேன் பத்து மணில இருந்து ஒரு மணி வரைக்கும் அவங்களுக்கு எடுத்தேன் ஸோ முப்பது மணி நேரத்துல மூணு மணி நேரத்தை இன்னைக்கு கவர் பண்ணியாச்சு ஸோ மீதி இருபத்தி ஏழு ஹவர்ஸை 
மண்டேல இருந்து ஃப்ரைடே வரைக்கும் எவ்ரி வீக் டே நான் மார்னிங் ஒன் ஹவர் ஒன் ஹவர் அவங்களுக்கு இருக்கும் அந்த கான்ட்ராக்ட் இப்போ இருக்கு ஸோ இதை நான் ஏன் உங்களுக்கு சொல்றேன்னு கேட்டீங்கன்னா அங்க நான் உங்களை பத்தி பேச அந்த கிளாஸ்ல உங்களை பத்தி நான் இன்னைக்கு பேச ஸோ நீங்க எப்படி நீங்க இந்த ஹாஸ்டல் எப்படி இருக்கீங்க உங்களுடைய ப்ராப்ளம்ஸ் எல்லாம் என்ன உங்க சேலஞ்சஸ் எல்லாம் என்ன அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு உங்களைத்தான் அங்க நான் உதாரணமா சொல்லியிருக்கேன் இப்ப வந்து உனக்கு வந்து ஒரு பிரச்சனை அப்படின்னு இருந்தா அந்த பிரச்சனையை பத்தி பேசறதுக்கு நாலு மணிக்கு காலேஜ் முடிஞ்சோம் நீ நேரம் வீட்டுக்கு போய் உங்க அப்பா அம்மா கிட்ட பேசுற பட் இந்த பொண்ணுக்கு அப்படி இல்லைன்னு சொல்லி உங்களை பத்தி பேசினேன் அண்ட் தோஸ் பாய்ஸ் அண்ட் கேர்ள்ஸ் ஹாவ் ஆஸ்ட் மீ டு கிவ் தேர் ரிசார்ட்ஸ் நாங்க ரொம்ப கேட்டா சொல்லுங்க சார் அப்படின்ட்டு பாய்ஸ் ஒரு ரெண்டு மூணு பேர் தான் பட் கேர்ள்ஸ் நிறைய பேர் வந்து கிளாஸ் முடிஞ்சோடனே எங்கிட்ட எல்லாரும் பாய்ஸ் சொல்லிட்டு போவாங்க நீங்க சொல்ற மாதிரி அப்போ அந்த பொண்ணு வந்து சொன்னாங்க சார் இந்த ஹோம்ல இருக்கவங்க எல்லாத்தையும் கேட்டா சொல்லுங்க அப்படின்னு சொல்லி சொன்னாங்க சோ அவங்க சொன்னத உங்க கிட்ட சொல்ல வேண்டியது என்னோட ரெஸ்பான்சிபிலிட்டி அவங்க எல்லாரும் உங்களுக்கு கேட்டத சொல்ல நான் கேட்டேன் என்ன கேட்டேன்னு சொல்றது அஜிமோல் இத கேட்டாங்க அப்படி என்ன கேட்டேன்னு சொல்ற சார் ஒண்ணுல இல்ல நான் நான் கேட்டேன்னு சொல்ல அப்படி நான் என்ன கேட்டேன் அப்படி சொல்லி சொல்றது ஜோக் ஜோக் அந்த ஜோக் உங்க யாருக்கு புரியல பரவாயில்ல இது ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டைம் நடக்கல பல தடவை இந்த மாதிரி நடந்துருக்கு கனிஷா கனிஷா மூஞ்சி பார்த்து தான் ஜோக் ரிசீவ் ஆயிருக்கா இல்லையா அப்படிங்கறத நான் புரிஞ்சு கனிஷா சரி கடைசியா <laughs> 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 கடைசியா ஒரு முக்கியமான விஷயம் இந்த ரெண்டு ஒரு <laughs> 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 இன்னொரு சிஆர்எஸ் அப்டேட் பார்த்துட்டு அந்த அவார்டு நான் உங்களுக்கு கொடுக்குறேன் ஓகே சார் ஒவ்வொருத்தங்களுக்கு குரூப் ஆ சார் ஒவ்வொருத்தங்களுக்கு தனித்தனியா கொடுப்பாங்க தனித்தனியா கொடுப்பீங்களா இல்ல குரூப் ஆ ஒரே ஒரு பிரைஸ் ஆ சார் அது நீ எவ்வளவு மார்க் வாங்கி இருக்கே அதுக்கு ஏத்த மாதிரி பிரைஸ் உன் கையில வந்து சேரும் ஓகே சார் ஓகே ரைட் ஃபைன் சோ நம்ம டியூஸ்டே மீட் பண்ணலாம் ரைட் புக் பண்ணுங்க Ah. Try, try there, sure, sure, sure. I'll definitely, I'll definitely try coming there. I'll be there. I'll be there. Don't worry. Sir! I'll be there. I'll be there. Don't worry. Sir! 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 ஒன்னும் <laughs> 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 அப்படின்னு <laughs> 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 Take care, take care. Good night. Bye, bye. Bye.
பாய் 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 1 வீக் போனதே தெரியலங்க சார் இப்போ நேத்து தான் நீங்க வந்து இந்த வீக்கெண்ட் என்ஜாய் பண்ணுங்கன்னு சொன்ன மாதிரி இருந்துச்சு சார் ஆமா சார் பரவாயில்லை நல்ல விஷயம் அப்ப நீங்க ரொம்ப இன்வால்டா இருக்கீங்க நாளைக்கு வரும்போது மித்ராவை கூட்டிட்டு வரீங்க சார் மித்ராவுக்கு நாளைக்கு एग्जाम மண்டே एग्जाम இருக்குமா அதுக்கு படிக்கிறன்னு சொல்லிருக்க அப்படி பட் வரணும்னு ரொம்ப ஆசை சரி ஐ ஹேவ் லெஃப்ட் இட் டு ஹர் ஏனா போயிட்டு வந்துட்டு சாயங்காலம் எனக்கு இமிடியேட்டா கிளாஸ் இருக்கு and she has to study பாக்குற முடிஞ்ச அளவுக்கு நான் கூப்பிட்டு வர பார்க்கிறேன் அண்ணா இப்ப போறப்ப எங்க கூட போறப்ப எங்க கூட வந்துரும் அப்படி அங்க அங்க இருந்து படிக்கணும் சொல்லி இருக்காங்க பாப் லெட்ஸ் சீ ஓகே ஓகே சார் சார் அவங்க டிஸ்டர்ப பண்ண வேணாம் சார் ஓகே ஓகே அவங்க படிக்கணும் சார் ஒரு நாள் தான சார் சரி பார்க்கலாம் அவ படிச்சிருவாங்க சார் கொஞ்ச நேரத்துல அவ படிச்சிருவாங்க சார் ஆடுங்கப்பா இது மித்ராக்கே தெரியாது சரி மித்ரா கரெக்ட் தெரிய பண்ண சொல்லுங்க சொல்றேன் 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 ஓகே சரி பாப்போம் நாளைக்கு பாப்போம் பாய் எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஸ் பாய் சார் பாய் 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 சார் சார் பாய் பாய் थैंक यू थैंक यू